inside the all new 2021 Regal 2800. We're gonna do a quick walkthrough and give you some live footage of this boat in the water. So join me. All right, let's kick this off with maybe my favorite space on the entire boat. It's this huge swim platform slash entertainment area. Now, if you're hanging out at a sandbar or at the island, everybody's going to want to hang out back here. So let me give you a few reasons why. Number one, it's close to the water. So hanging out back here, this is right down at the water level, making it easy to get in and out of this boat. If you've got drinks or snacks laid out, it's a great place to set those items. Of course, you've got stainless steel drink holders up here. Your stereo system, your fusion stereo system, top of the line, best in the industry. You've got that right here at your fingertips. And of course, the uh, uh, aft stereo remote. So again, all of the beautiful features back here. Again, love the refreshment cooler back here too. What a great idea. You also have the wash down conveniently hidden back here as well. But just can't get over how big this swim platform is and how great it is when you're entertaining uh, out on the lake. Now, stainless steel swim ladder is tucked in nicely underneath the swim platform here. It's a telescoping three steps and it gets down nice and deep in the water so it's easy to get in here. Now, if you don't want to be in the water or sitting on the swim platform, you do have another choice. And you've got these beautiful, uh, high-backed, comfortable 38 ounce loungers back here that recline just as easy as that. There's also a filler cushion that goes in here, so if you really want to lay out, bake under the sun, you've got that option too. But again, this is an area that you're going to spend a tremendous amount of time back here on the 2800. Inside the Regal 2800 cockpit here, you're going to find some things that are key and different than any other boat in its category, starting with the comfort curve. Now, this might seem like it's insignificant, but trust me, it's not. This little cutout here makes all the difference in the world because it allows you to effectively sit two more people in the cockpit and it's a comfortable seat. Now, if this is 90 off here, then that would be a seat that's very difficult to sit in, but because it's cut out like this, it gives you a comfortable seat to recline, get back into the corner, and again, utilize all that precious square footage inside the cockpit. One of the other things you're gonna love is storage. Now, Regal keys in on this on every model they build and they left nothing to chance with the 2800. So great storage. You got storage for everything. You'll see the teak table stowed away nicely in there. You've got the igloo cooler that's removable stowed in here. Your battery on off switch is conveniently located there. And we also have a storage locker inside here. And notice how everything is just finished off really nicely. You've got these gas assist rams that hold all the storage compartments open. Everything is finished. You've got the nice matting down below. Uh, there's a rubber gasket here. Now don't let that detail slip by because this reduces sound and vibration and make sure this is a watertight compartment. So I love the attention to detail everywhere you look. And again, storage is key. There's actually one more storage compartment up here which is great again nice deep finished storage compartments here next i want to highlight just how beautiful this interior is and you got this diamond uh stitched interior here you love the the attention to detail the, the use of different fabrics and finishes here the chrome accenting the stainless steel cup holders the fusion stereo system here they did, a, they, they, they did a lot here to add detail and beauty to the inside of the cockpit here. Moving further forward in the cockpit here, you're going to love these double wide captain's chairs here. And they're comfortable, they're beautiful, and look at the flexibility here. You have uh, seat backs that rock forward and backwards here, giving you a lot of versatility depending on how you're entertaining your guests. You have tons of versatility in the 2800, but love the beauty. Stainless steel grab handles here. Okay, moving into the helm here, check this out. We've got a hand-stitched stainless steel custom steering wheel here. It's tilt to whatever comfort level you want the steering wheel at. And then look how beautiful and seamless the dash is here. You've got two uh, Volvo Penta glass cockpit screens here. They're seven inch screens, they're color, touch screen, they're high speed, absolutely beautiful and allows you to multifunction on the fly. 
rocker panel switches here. And then look at the ergonomics here. I just love the attention to detail that Regal put into this space here. Starting with the armrest here. So when you're pulling tubers or skiers, you've got a great place to rest your arm, feather the throttle, or if you're just out for a boat cruise, again, great ergonomics. You can adjust the steering wheel. I've got a great place to put my feet. And then the view, right? You've got the Taylor curved windshield here. Absolutely stunning. Stainless steel header here. And again, just love the detail. Vinyl wrapped dash. I mean, the whole thing's vinyl wrapped with uh, contrasting stitching. Bow thruster located up here. You've got the trim tab switches here. Again, love the detail here that Regal put into the cockpit. Now, moving over to the port side here. Again, leaving no detail out. Everything is vinyl wrapped and hand stitched. Don't you just love the gorgeous detail here? Fusion head unit here is located. We've got stainless steel cup holders all over the place. And then an absolutely beautiful, spacious head with the vessel bowl sink, driftwood cabinetry, and then of course the port light window. Love the bow walkthrough doors here. And again, check out the attention to detail. Everything is stainless steel here. You got beautiful tinted safety glass here. Goes in, locks into place here. Revealing you've got a trash container here and then more storage here. Now, some of our competitors use uh, some very cheap materials to build in their bow walkthrough doors, but not Regal. Again, everything stainless steel. And you can see it's just gorgeous. Love the attention to detail here. Now, talking about details, getting in and out of this boat, of course, you can load on the extra large beam to beam swim platform in the back. That's great, but if you're coming off of a high dock and you need to get into the boat, you've got this beautiful teak here, overlay, so you can step onto the boat and in comfortably. Love that. Also love the eight pound magnet that holds this windshield in place. Well, at speed here, this is great. Instead of having a canvas strap or a, some kind of button hook to hold it down, uh, love, the, love the eight pound magnet here. And again, just look how nice they did with the bow rails here. Stainless steel, low profile, gives it a really good look, but it functions well uh, uh, to boot. Now, this area, it's deep, it's spacious, and it's extremely comfortable. You've got great built-in armrests here that bolster and kind of keep you into the seat. Lots of stainless steel cup holders. Again, Fusion audio system up here. Uh, those are backlit speakers. Uh, they sound great and they look even cooler in the evening. Now, up front here, we've got the oversized stainless steel cleats. Now, Regal used the oversized uh, permanent fixed place stainless steel cleats because they want you to have the ability to not only tie a big heavy duty docking line, but also add fenders. So great thinking again from Regal. Okay, love this windless storage compartment here. Again, uh, nice, clean, easy to get at. And then of course the shark eye navigation light up here. Sparing no detail, just love the fit and finish of this 2800. Okay, so I wanna demonstrate one of Regal's trademarks. One thing that has absolutely changed the industry and that is the power tower. Regal was first to the market with a power tower design, full fiberglass tower at the touch of a button. It goes up and down. This is great. If you got a boat hoist, you're coming in underneath the canopy, you press the button, it folds down, you glide in, it's that easy. Touch the button. I love this. Stowed beneath this canvas here is a huge bimini top. So on those days where it's really hot out, you need a little break from the sun, in two minutes you can have this thing deployed. And not to mention, you can leave it out all day because it's a high speed bimini and that you can run 45 miles an hour with it deployed. It also has your navigation light nicely placed up here, as well as a ski pylon for wakeboarding or wake sports activities. Since we're talking conveniences and access, I just wanted to demonstrate how easy this windlass is to use. No more drawing the short straw. Who's gonna throw the anchor and bail it back up? I'll volunteer for this any day. Love how easy it is to lower the stay in the steel, anchor down and draw it back up. that one more thing that i want to add here is this comes with the optional bow thruster making this a docking sensation press the button and away you go bow away i can bring it back to you i love 
love how easy this is, especially when you get caught in a crosswind, to turn the boat on a dime. 